What's going on guys? Tonight I want to talk about a super cool plant that happens to be one of my favorites right now and that is aquarium pearlweed. I've been growing pearlweed in a bunch of aquariums and I think it is the best non-CO2 carpeting plant that you can use. I've been using it in probably like seven different tanks right now and here's what it looks like here in the front. This is my 10 gallon aquarium rack. There's six tens here. Hey, Whiskey, hey, what are you doing? You just coming by? But anyways, guys, the best low tech carpeting plant is pearlweed in my personal opinion. And this is what the plant looks like. Uh, chances are you're researching pearlweed for a specific reason and it's to CO2, or not CO2, but to carpet a aquarium. Here it is in this tank down here. Here it is in this tank over here. As you can see, it works really well with super easy, low-tech aquarium setups. These are just Hyger, Amazon cheap LED plants. And all you gotta do, Whiskey's sitting here trying to get the, the beta. Get him, get him boy, get him. Come on, get him. Don't judge me, this beta has a little bit of fin rot. He's from a big box chain store, so we're trying to treat that as well. Um, I just got this guy over here. It's a King Koi. Um, he is absolutely amazing, I love him. I gotta clean that glass, don't judge me. But yeah guys, Pearlweed is simply the easiest non-CO2 plant to carpet in aquarium. All you gotta do is get your scissors in here and start trimming it. And all you gotta do is use the tweezers and just replant it. And what's cool is actually when you trim this stuff, you can plant it horizontal. And actually, a lot of people don't know this, but if you're trying to CO2 pearl, or if you're trying to carpet pearlweed, gosh, I got the whole dang zoo down here. What are you doing, Teddy? What are you doing? Hey guys, you guys buddies. But yeah, pearlweed, if you actually trim it enough, the plant in itself will grow immune to getting cut and it will start growing horizontal instead of vertical. You can carpet it that way or else you can just cut it and simply just keep planting all these stems. It's it's literally that simple. Um, and these are Nikru lights. Or no, these aren't the Nikru ones. These are the Mendak ones. And actually, the other thing we're doing with aquarium pearlweed is we're planting it in a lot of tanks to use as breeding setups. Hey, what do you guys got to say? Can you at least let me shoot a video? Hey, hey, leave me alone, leave me alone. But as I was saying, uh, we're planting it in a lot of the tanks to help breed a lot of the fish. You can see in the back there, we're planting it. And what happens is the mollies, when they wanna go lay babies, as you can see, there's little babies in here, they go over to the pearl weed and it's great cover for the babies. It gives them a lot of coverage. And as you can see, we're getting a lot more babies. Come on, focus. Um, but yeah, also over here, we, we're starting to plant the pearl weed over there for these platies and it's working quite well. So not only is it a super easy plant to use as a carpet, but it's also great coverage for breeding live bears. So if you're planning on possibly doing that, it's a great, it's a great plant to use. God, sorry, sorry, these kitties are way too cute. As you can see here, <laughs> look at that. Look at that. It's just showboating over here, just showboating. So as you can see, this tank over here, um, these guppies are using that pearlweed as coverage to lay babies and it works quite well. And actually what I did here, I did a comparison of two, hey, you two stop fighting. I did a comparison of these two plants because the microsword and pearlweed are two common carpeting non-CO2 plants that people use, and this is the difference. The pearlweed worked out great, and the microsword not so great. Hey, hey. <laughs> Look at these two. Look at this, they just know it's, whoa, whoa. We got Fight Club up in here, Fight Club. Hey, you two chill. <sighs> All right, guys, as per usual, it's chaos around here. All the house plants are doing great. The house is amazing. Um, I just picked up this new Fluvo Flex. 
<sighs> what else is there? I've been working on the back of this entertainment center. It's turning out quite well. There's going to be some 20 talls here, another 55 gallon up here. God, the camera keeps coming out of zoom. This tank is looking amazing. Um, if you guys want more updates, check out my main channel at Palmer Aquatics. This is kind of just another one of my off branch channels that I use to kind of just log some of my experiences, do small little clips and such. So uh, if you guys like fish tanks, uh, also let me know in the comments section what you think of pearlweed and are you going to be using it in a non CO2 setup because it is a great low tech non-CO2 carpeting plant. Let me know in the comment section. I want to hear from you guys.